What's up guys, today I have a Japanese version of Metal Gear Solid. Let's take a look inside and see how it stacks up. Alright, so here's the game. We'll do a little quick overview. So basically the game came out in 98. Um, it was first shown off in E3 in 97. Um, Haido Kojima made the game, he wrote it, produced it, directed, you know, basically was the man of the game. Um, so it's, it's just a really popular game. Um, even proof of that is it was a 94 out of 100 on Metacritic, so uh, that's kind of a lot. <laughs> um, pretty big deal for a PlayStation game. So a uh, revolutionary game, it's one of my favorites, definitely probably in my top five, if not my top game of all time. Um, I wanted to get a Japanese version just for a display purpose. Uh, maybe in the future I'll get a Japanese uh, PlayStation or maybe try and mod one so I can play the game. Um, so anyway, let's take a look inside and see what we got. So I got this game recently from an eBay um, purchase, so I'll put the link up here. Um, it's a complete set. The quality is, you know, I don't know, I'd probably give it like a 6 out of 10, but it has everything in it. So, you know, all the, um, there's only one instruction booklet and the paper and everything is intact. So the jewel is, jewel case is kind of cracked right here. But um, other than that, it's, uh, it's a good display piece. So let's go ahead and take a look. So we got disc three, I guess it's out of order. Disc three, disc one, disc two. So, um, yeah, obviously out of order. Maybe there might have been another um, instruction booklet there, but um, let's go ahead and take a look at the instruction booklet. So technical espionage action, Metal Gear Solid. Um, I'm assuming that is something related in Japanese. Got 97, 98, or 1987 to 98 Konami, all rights reserved. We got Snake on the cover there. I can't read any of that, but if I could, I would tell you. <laughs> um, we got Snake with the cool artwork, Outer, Outer Heaven, a little bit of the history, not in English. Maryland Snake. Some more artwork. Controls here, you got your dual shock and your regular controller. I don't know how easy it is to play this with just a regular controller. I think you almost need a dual shock, especially for the Psycho Mantis scene. Spoiler alert. Uh, little screenshots. Can I tell you probably the CQC stuff? HUD instructions or HUD layout. How you can get spotted. I think, oh, this is shown the camera. So you can do it over the head and then angle and then first person. You know, when you're craw crawling, you can see right there. This is really bright. <laughs> so I guess this is showing you the, um, when you get caught, you know, green means no one has your, your attention. Yellow means um, people are looking for you. And then obviously alert, so also the signs. Some more mini stuff. Some codec information. Got Campbell. Little layout of, uh, I think this is the first level right here. Probably tells you what to do. You see it's stuck. Oh, continuation. Oh, here's the CQC stuff. Here's some artwork of the characters, pretty cool. Got Solid Snake, Foxhound, Meryl Silverberg, Foxhound, 
There's Campbell, Naomi, Mei Ling, all foxhound. Well, she doesn't have foxhound. Some more awesome artwork, Liquid Snake, Revolver Ocelot, probably my favorite character. Vulcan Raven, Sniper Wolf, Psycho Mantis, Decoy Octopus. What else do you see? Oh, Fox Sound. The little English that I can read. Uh, some of the, the troops. Got the Ninja, Big Boss, Fox Sound. Fox Sound as well. Bunch of the other supporting characters. Foxhound for Miller. And then DARPA. AWAX. So yeah, pretty cool. A little sticker right here. I'm not sure what that's for. Uh, does that have the Doesn't show it here. The codec number that you need to call. Let's see if it's on the back of the jewel. Oh, right there. <laughs> There's the codec. So yeah, just like the US version. Except ours doesn't say for Japan only. <laughs> There's the dual shock. So yeah, pretty cool complete version. I'm gonna go ahead and Fix this. Fix this or this is bothering me. So quality of the disc is pretty good. Disc one, disc two, not bad either. Disc three. Thank you guys for watching. Um, just wanted to show you what would be inside the Japanese version of the Metal Gear Solid PlayStation game. So probably what I'm gonna do with this is um, make the make it out of a display, like I said in the beginning of the video. I'm not sure if I wanna have it open or have the, um, do something like this. The jewel and the um, pamphlet, maybe have it open with um, some of the characters here would be kind of cool with the artwork. So, um, not too sure. I don't like this page, but we'll see. Um, I'll maybe do a follow-up video or maybe follow a picture or something. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.